I have this cute little half circle rug in front of my refrigerator and it never moves because it is being held in place by ruggies. I have this cute little rectangle rug near my front door and it never moves because it's held in place by ruggies. I have this long runner in my hallway and it always moves. There's nothing that has been able to hold it in place, especially with the cats running on it. So what I am going to do is I am going to put some ruggies underneath it and let's see how well the ruggies do. These are what the ruggies look like. They are triangles and they are basically, they're like a sticky plastic or a sticky rubber um, or sticky vinyl. They're just, there's some kind of squishy soft material. You stick these underneath the rug and uh, then you stick the rug to your floor and it does not damage the floor but it keeps the rug from moving around. Now for some rugs like the other two rugs that I showed you uh, when I tried to put these on the rug they don't stick to the rug they just come right off the rug and if that happens they give you these other pieces I don't know what these other pieces are they're like um, another stronger sticker material and you put this on the rug first then you attach the ruggy to this and then you put it on the floor so um, we'll see what happens with this runner this is a very old rug um, I inherited it from my grandparents it's Bellistan 100% worsted wool. We're going to see how these ruggies work on it. I just applied one of the ruggies underneath the rug to the corner of the rug. It appears to have stuck to this rug, maybe because it's a natural material. I don't know. But I'll put this down on the floor and let's see if the rug comes up or if it actually works. I just put the rug down on the floor and it appears to be holding. So I am going to do um, all four corners of the rug and then I'm also going to do some sections in the middle of the rug because I do have eight ruggies and because this rug, this rug is like 10 or 11 feet long. Um, so that's what I'm going to do. I'll space them out um, along the underside of the rug and the corners and I'll be so happy if it holds the rug in place. Okay, so as I was trying to apply the middle ruggies and I was moving the rug, it literally just came right off of these pieces. So I'm going to put the extra sticky material on these and then put the rug back on it and hopefully it'll hold it better. So I am applying these black vinyl stickers to the bottom of the rug and then I am going to apply the ruggies to these and then it should help the rug stick to the floor better. And there is the ruggy on top of that black sticker. I try to line them up as well as I can. And there's another one. And these are the ones that I'm using in the middle of the rug. Okay, so now I don't want much from these ruggies. All I want is the rug to stay in place when the cats run on it. And right before I started filming this video, I was playing with Boo with the laser pointer in the hallway. And he ran onto the rug and the rug just totally slid down the hall and uh, freaked him out and I don't want to do that. So let's see what happens now. Come on, Boo. Oh my god, the rug stayed in place, look! So far, Boo has been running on the rug, and it has not been moving. If this rug stays in place, it'll be such a great exercise area for the cats. If I could just get them to run up and down this hall a bunch of times. Or if they start wanting to run up and down the hall because the rugs aren't moving. Here's Simba now. Look at that. The rug did not move. Oh, 
look, look. The rug did not move. Look at this. The rug is not moving. Um, that being said, my concern is if the cats start sharpening their nails on this rug and really start tearing into it, like they sometimes do, is uh, is that going to make the rug move? But right now, just them running on it, just running on it and lunging, the rug is staying still. The rug is not moving around. Yeah, so, so these are ruggies. Unfortunately, I can't show you the box because someone puked on the box. So this will be the third rug that I have ruggies under. And uh, if this rug stays put, it'll be a miracle. And uh, we'll most likely put ruggies under my other rugs also. It is 9.30 p.m. and I'm in the hallway with Boo and we've been playing with the laser pointer and Boo has been running up and down the hallway and the rug has not moved. So I was out all afternoon and I came back and the rug was where I left it and Boo was just running up and down the rug and it's still where it was. It has not moved. These ruggies are like the best thing ever for keeping rugs in place. Okay, so it is 10, 17 p.m. I just came upstairs and somehow the rug is now off of the ruggies. I don't know how that happened and I don't know who did it, but yeah, look, two ruggies. Three ruggies, five ruggies, the rug is off the ruggies. It's now two weeks later and this rug still does not stick to the ruggies. Now the ruggies are stuck to the floor and every day I position this rug back on top of the ruggies but the side of the ruggies that attaches to the rug does not have any stick left on it, like it's non-stick at this point. So the rug just keeps sliding around the hall. And this is what's going on here. You can see this is the sticker part that was attached to the rug. And then um, here's the other part. So we can pick those up off the floor. They don't leave any residue or anything. And um, they're still very sticky on the floor because if I move them, and put them back down they stick really well it's just the part that sticks it to the rug that has lost uh, its stickiness yeah there's nothing there's no stickiness left on there it's all rug fibers and cat hair at this point so so these are gonna have to uh, come up off of the floor I don't even know if these things are like reusable on other rugs um, or not and this side also retains its stickiness so I just wanted to film this update um, because, yeah, these ruggies do not work with this runner um, at all. But they do work fine with the smaller rug. This rug never moves. And they also work fine with this smaller rug. This rug never moves. So would I buy more ruggies? Yes, I would for smaller rugs. And would I recommend this product? Uh, again, yes, I would for smaller rugs but it just is not a good solution for this runner um, or maybe this type of rug. Thank you for watching this Lucky Pearls video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you'd like me to post more videos and please make sure to check out these other videos that were selected especially for you.